New details into the newsroom on the arsenal of weapons seized from the VTA shooter San Jose home. Thousands of rounds of ammunition, weapons, and Molotov cocktails. KPIX finds Len Ramirez is live there now for us with what authorities are discovering. Len? That's right. They revealed today not only that large arsenal inside his home, but also how he apparently timed a fire to start it at his house at the same time as the mass shooting. A neighbor's surveillance camera caught the suspect, Sam Cassidy, leaving for work the morning of the VTA massacre. Today, investigators revealed that Cassidy left his home with rounds of ammunition slow cooking in a pot on his stove. The ammunition in that pot would have heated to a point where uh, the powders inside would have, would have detonated and likely ignited the accelerants in the kitchen, uh, causing that residence to catch fire. The fire happened at about the same time Cassidy was gunning down nine of his co-workers at the VTA yard. Investigators also recovered a dozen firearms, including rifles and handguns with high-capacity magazines, 17 Molotov cocktails, and bullets too numerous to count. We've been removing ammunition from the residents for about the past two days. Uh, the new estimate is roughly 25,000 rounds of ammunition in various calibers. San Jose Police Bomb Squad technicians thought they came across a booby trap device in the home's attic. We found a suspicious device. We're not sure what it is, so we're going to render it safe. Police blew it up, but it was only a discarded box of batteries and wires. Police had evacuated the entire cul-de-sac where Cassidy lived, plus two houses on the back side. Neighbors were eager to get back home after three days and grateful that there was no more loss of life. I didn't expect to have all the, all the stuff for inside though. You know, I thought it was his normal person. So I just found out I was a little scared. And there continues to be a police presence here at the cul-de-sac where Mr. Cassidy lived, but only in a security uh, function. There's a couple of work crews that are securing up the house after all of those uh, weapons and devices were removed from the house over the past couple of days. Alan, uh, the residents who live around here will be able to return to their homes within the next couple of hours. Well, I'll breathe a sigh of relief. Hey, Len, do we know, were there any performance issues during Cassidy's time with the VTA? Well, the uh, VTA released a statement today saying that uh, contrary to some earlier reports that uh, there was a uh, hearing uh, scheduled for the day of the shooting, uh, the VTA says that was not uh, the case. Uh, there was some reporting that there had been a performance issue, a Skelly hearing perhaps uh, that day, but the VTA says no. They are looking, however, into his background, uh, but have not released any details if there was anything in his background that would have alerted officials or concerned officials about uh, racist comments or anything like that. We should be learning more about that, though, probably in the next couple of weeks. Okay, Len, got it. Thanks so much.